Hey friends, I just wanted to do a quick video. I've been quiet the last couple of days and I've had people reaching out and asking why I've not said anything, especially about the election. Um, obviously it was a blow. It was, it was very difficult. Tune in for tonight's episode of We're Stitching the Tapestry. It's our first of final seven episodes. We will be talking about why we're ending the show and we will be talking about the election. Uh, you're probably wondering why I'm in my car. I am getting ready to do some uh, PFLAG office hours to provide support for other members of the LGBTQ plus community. But you know, I've been spending the day recuperating, spending time with my fiance, being available for my students who might need who might need some emotional support. But I wanted to hop on and do a video to hopefully provide some encouragement during these difficult times. First, I want to thank, I want to thank everyone who took time and who were able to reach out to me and check in. I've had so many people reaching out, especially people in the Godzilla fandom. I, you know my journey. I, I've always struggled to find my place in the Godzilla fandom. And to have everyone reach out and to just check in if we're okay, that meant so much to me, especially amid like the emotional tumult, the difficult conversations I've had to have with my family who made election decisions contrary to my well-being and my fiance's well-being. It meant a lot to have that support, and I want you to know that that's seen. And I hope that I was able to provide that support for some too. Because many of us are grieving right now. Many of us feel very isolated and alone. And to those who do, I want you to know that we're in this together. We're all in this together. I can't stop thinking about, like whenever I'm going through grief like this, I think about my favorite characters. I think about what they would do. I keep posing the question of uh, what would Mothra do? Or what would Godzilla do? They would keep fighting. Even if the odds seem against them, they would keep fighting. They would protect their friends. They would protect those they care about. They would stand up for those they care about. And that's what we do for each other. That's what we do for each other. And during this time, if you need someone to talk to, please reach out to someone. Okay? This isn't over. And the truth is, during these times, what we do is we have to most importantly be there for ourselves. But we have to remember that our voice in this story matters. Eventually, we will be able to show up again. We will feel fortified again. And we will find the strength to keep moving forward again. We have to grant ourselves the grace of grief first. Okay? I love you all. Don't give up. And know that I love you. And that I'll always have your back. Talk soon. Take care.